Don't come up up. Don't come up up and see the pumps. No. No, you're too tired. I made the new coffee, by the way, that uh, Queen Pleb got from the market stall. Oh my god, it's so good. Oh my god, it's out of this world. I genuinely, it's so nice. I think doing that will make me not buy Starbucks and stuff as much. I All I need to do is learn how to make good iced coffee at home. That's what I need to do. You're new here? Welcome. It's not, that's a, it's not a brand. So in my city... We've got a market stall that it's a Colombian um, farm that makes coffee and they ship it from their farm to their market stall stalls. And uh, so it's directly from Colombia. Hey, Bushy. So this is literally as fresh coffee from it's a dark roast, strong dark roast because I like strong coffee. It's so good. Oh. It's so good. Ooh, nice. Mm hmm. And there, Queen Pleb has never been to that market store before, but I, I've been there quite a few times. I told her about it. So she went there on a lunch break because she was she's doing a bit of a weird week that she was she's normally in the office Tuesday, Wednesday. She's in the office because of her car MOT uh, yesterday and today. So she went yesterday and it was uh, it was her gift to me um, for getting her car MOT sorted. So that's what I got. Fair enough. Hey, Niara, 46 months tier one says morning. Good morning, Erin Niara. Hello. I've got the Roomba on downstairs and I've got my vacuum, uh, my hot oven on for the alarm when the sausages are done. So it's like hard to hear everything. Early allow we were. Mooks books. Hello, Vika. I'm doing pretty good. I'm tired because I just I got back from doing like an hour long dog walk with Maya to try and make her tired for like the whole stream because yesterday she kind of perked up after four hours. I'm hoping at least we can go five today. So that South Indian filter coffee. Yeah, that sounds good. I will sure give it a go one day. Hey, Morgan. Oh, you're saying hello to the plebs that have just come in. There. There, there, there. There, there, there. there, there, there. there, there. I'll commit it now. Why not? Hello, Jibus. <laughs> 79 months with Prime Kazakhs mid when? Maybe tomorrow, because if we're doing a 12 hour stream, we might do some viewer games. Uh <clears throat> Oh, 
Turkish coffee. I've heard that's really good, like with the sand and stuff. I've obviously I've never had it, but I'd probably give it a go. Oh, that's fair, Moxim. It's okay, buddy. I want that Poro thing so bad. It's so cool. We had um we had an incident with Maya yesterday, by the way, everybody. We we had an incident. Miss Maya, um, I might tell the story a couple times today. This is the first time she's ever done it. And I'm sure she'll, you know, it's a dog thing and she'll do it, you know, more. Um, she's been really interested in a, in a certain corner of my garden for the last few weeks. And we've not known why. We thought maybe a cat got back there or something. Anyway, after the stream... Bef like I before I started doing the editing block, I was like, "Oh, I'll just go check. Maya's doing all right." Uh, she, the back door was open uh, for the garden, so she was she was in that area, and I was like, "Oh, dude, there's nothing there." Like, what I'll do, like it's near where my bins are, so I move the bins out the way and be like, "Look, you can have a proper good look. There's nothing there." Oh, there was something there. There, uh, uh, yep, that was a mistake. That uh, there was something there. Yep. Yep. Um, so it looked to a bit. I don't know if it was a mouse or a rat's nest. Um, but there was only one little baby and she got hold of it. Now, the good news is she didn't eat it. I made her not eat it, but she did kill it. Yeah. It was. It, it did actually impact me a bit, which is, you know, I spoke to Queen Pleb about it. Like, I'm, I'm a massive meat eater, and I'm, I'm fine with that. But it was a bit different when it's my own pet, you know, my own dog, my own, my own daughter of my heart. This poor little, uh, this poor little mouse or whatever it was. It was obviously, it was, oh, because I had to try and get Maya away from it, and she kept putting it in her mouth and running away from me. Yeah. I did get her to drop it because, again, she is trained well. So for her to actually drop it and go away, it just shows how well trained she is. Hey, Liramix. Uh, potentially, if today goes insane, but we'd have to be on a very big win streak. I'm trying to just aim within Diamond 1 today. We're, we're, we're Diamond 1, 0 LP because we lost our first game since getting promoted. If we can just get to, like, 40, 50 plus LP, I'd be pretty happy today. Just, like, secure Diamond 1. Uh, it's technically still morning, yeah. Technically. I want my sausages to be ready. They might actually be ready already. When's the best time to go get my sausages? Like, I'm really strong right now. Maybe I'll wait till a bigger power spike. Then I'll go get my sausages. None will escape my grass. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. We're going for it, baby. We're going for it. We're going for 10. We're going for 10, baby. <laughs> if this thing, if the loot subscription keeps giving us spatulas, it is possible. <laughs> Ooh. I was so close a few nights ago. You need three. You need seven. There's seven natural story weavers, so you need three spats. 
You guys have bunning snags. I have no idea what that is. So sausages from a barbecue you cook out outside a hardware store. That's the most Australian thing I've ever heard. <sighs> 10,000 HP Gallia. What the heck? It's uh, cloth. Oh, we got it! We got it! We can go seven! We just need eco! We just need eco and level! Ooh. If I get knocked out before, I'm going to be so sad. <laughs> oh, I'm hyped. Please, this could even be uploaded to YouTube. This could be one I upload. Come on. Come on, lads. I'll have to save the sausages for after. The oven does turn off when the alarm goes off, but they'll they'll probably continue cooking a bit to like the, the heat staying in the oven. But that's fine. <sighs> right, what I really have to do just mentally in my head, don't blow it when it comes to eco. I need to get to level 10. I can't waste gold on re-rolls and all that. That's going to be the problem, is if I am trying to get to level 10, but I'm actually too weak, and I get killed before I get to level 10. Obviously, we still have to find an Aurelia as well. And I, Aurelia always is my crux. I can never find Aurelias. Yeah, go for it, Moxon. Yeah, I'll get seven story weaver early, which is pretty powerful. So that should help. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Oh. Shmi shmi. Hello, Shmion. This has woken me up a bit. Yeah, we're not very strong right now at all. So we are going to be burning a bit of health, but that's fine. I might go warden, like the, the things that I'm going to put Story Weaver on. I might actually just do wardens for like absolute frontline. Sounds quite good to me. <laughs> if we can get a gold or XP or something, I don't know. I want it. I want it all, and I want it now. I want this Galio. That's what I want. Come join my team, friend. Come closer. No, as yet, Alurimix. No, they said it was very likely to be um, the beginning of next week. I'm presuming they were still interviewing today, even. Like, they might have been doing a, a final interview today um i asked queen player because obviously i've said you guys like her role is quite senior so she's interviewed and all that stuff um oh my god moxham jesus christ um oh my god that's won't die um i said how many people will they likely have in final interviews she's like eh, maybe three so if i had mine tuesday maybe they did another one wednesday and maybe the, the last person couldn't interview until today And if I win any rounds, it's a bonus right now. I'm not expecting to win basically any rounds. Hey, cat. Hopefully, I can start winning rounds when I hit seven. Story weaver, though. Violence 
I don't oh, screw it. I'm not even gonna go for three stars. I'm gonna use all the all the gold on just leveling. And if a unit comes up I need, I'll take it. I also need to find another severe just so it replaces the Aurelia or the items. I think my vacuum cleaner's done downstairs. And if you guys haven't bought a Roomba, please do. It changes your life. Oh my god. Especially if you've got a dog. Oh, he's got a Galio, you bumhead. Kill the Galio. Now the Iode. Oh. Oh, that's, again, that, ooh, that's a lot of health losing. Like, we need to stabilize, otherwise we're not making it to 10 just based on health. <laughs> oh, no. No. Imagine, imagine if we get knocked out before we can get to 10. We have 10 Story Weaver, like, banked. Nice. There's the other Severe we need as well. Perfect. Oh, I'm tempted to buy that. If I get gold, I'll buy that Amumu. Because, again, I want to make all the things I'm putting story with it on Wardens. Oh, really? Any error? Ah. Oh, it just gave me an Amumu I'm hacking. Nice. Nice. Boom. Alright, seven. Dude, okay, we've got a lot of gold. It just randomly gave me a lot of gold. What the heck? Why did it just give me so much gold? I'm happy. I'm nearly also level eight. Let's go. Come on, baby. Let's go. I'm hyped. I'm hyped. Augment? Oh, was it the augment? It might have been the loot subscription given gold, yeah. Hey, nice Jesus, you got this buddy. Oh dear. Come on, lads. If you get through that thing, then the enemy team should just fall. Oh, dude, they're so tanky. Come on! Da -da 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 -da. All right, we're starting to win. We might have stabilized. Let's go. Come on, we can do it, guys. I'm so hyped. I'm legit so hyped. If we, I've never got 10 story weaver. Come on. Ooh, I quite like that for this team. That's quite good. Ooh, open a special shop with three five cost... With three, three, I might go that for Galio. Oh, wait, you only can pick one, but you get two copies of it. I'm going to go with that, I think. Yeah. Oh, we got Galio. Let's go. <laughs> we actually got the Galio we needed. <laughs> oh. We just have to find Aurelia and get 10. That's all we got to do. So I'm going to do that just so it's on the Amumu. Oh, yeah, probably. Yeah, for now, I probably should have put the Galio instead of the Garen for four Warden. Oh, wait, no, that would have. He's Warden as well. Hmm. It, well, Galio is a stronger unit than Garen. So, yeah, it would have been a better thing to go anyway for now. And I'm starting to win rounds. I'm starting to win rounds. Let's go. We're not losing health. <laughs> Hello, and Sand Slash. Wait. Oh, he's not a... Oh, he's a bruiser. Oh, I thought Gally was Warden. Tell everybody I'm on my way. So if I do that, and then that, because Gar Garen one is not stronger than that. That's better. All right. Again, Aurelia should be. We should be able to find the Aurelia 100% when we get to level 10. Because our chances of finding legendary units will be stupidly high. 
I believe. I believe. Yeah, it's true. I could put Garen in for Zoe to get four Warden. That's true. Or Garen over Zyra just to make the front line. Because again, it's the Severe and Kale that are doing all the damage. Oh, I'm so hyped. I've not got it this yet. I nearly... I had nine Story Weaver. And I... And I had enough to get, um, I had enough to get to 10, or had everything to get to 10, but I got knocked out before 10. It was the saddest day of my life. Hey, Mr. Legend. Mine. I love taking stuff when people need it. <laughs> it's just like, ah, you had a plan with that. Oh, fiery hot sauce. Oh, I, I get that, my dude. Hell yeah. I'm... Me and uh, Queen Pleb are vaguely starting to think about wedding stuff. Like, vaguely. Um, and, you know, I'm looking forward to, to, to the wedding and that. But, I, I all, you know, we all know, like, the wedding itself, a lot of it is more, or sometimes more for the, for the woman. But... I, I'm looking forward to it, and I'm going to help plan it and everything. You know, I'm going to be terrible with colours because I'm colourblind. Uh, but I will give my input as much as I can. Hey, Joe Magic. Yeah, thanks, Fire Hot Sauce. Welcome from the YouTube channel. <gasps> This is a stupidly tanky Orn, by the way. What's even killing my Severe in the back line? Was it Zaya? I think it was Zaya. Yeah, I'm planning on getting rid of Jax for set and then swapping the items. That was already in my mind. I will not Should have done that as well. So that makes my front line hopefully really tanky. 20% less damage. So they take 20% less damage for the first 10 seconds, is it? And then they take 15% even more? I don't know. Almost all garden gnomes have red hats. It's a little gnome fact. Oh my god. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, I mean, I can put Zoe next to Kale, but she does such little damage, it's basically irrelevant. Hey! Someone's plushie just arrived again, because I've got stream mode on, I actually can't see who it is. The name begins with R. Ah, it's Roger. Hell yeah. Oh, very cool, D-Dum. Do you watch any truck drivers like um, Luke C and HGV or anyone? Because I, I actually watch quite like a couple of truck drivers and, you know... No intention of being a truck driver, but it's just actually very interesting. I'm just gonna mana Zane and put it now I put it on the Zoe. Now she might do some damage. Do, 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 do. 
Come on, Kale. Put your back into it. Ow. Dude, Kaiser damage. I think I can make it to 10, though. So, again, my health is not looking amazing. But, I, again, we've been in a weakened state of not re-rolling, not looking for, like, level 2 Galio because we're using all our gold to level. That's all we're doing. Ooh, I quite like that. Four re-rolls. That's good for me. All right, you go back in. All right, and now we get to level ten in the next. Well, probably I'll probably hit level ten if I'm if I'm comfortable to do so after carousel, because then I cannot break my eco completely, and then we'll hopefully have enough gold to roll and get to ten, and also find an Aurelia. Hey, Articus. Hopefully we just get an Aurelia on the carousel. That would like literally be the amazing thing. Oh, it's another Orn. Ito tanki. Again, if we get through that Orn, we should rip through their whole team. The rest of them aren't actually that tanky at all. Okay, he's panicking, or he's got even an augment, or he's panicking putting items on. Oh, I don't think we have enough damage. Oh, his damage also is quite high in the back line. Okay, Ooh, we should be fine. I don't think we'll get... Oh, this is going to be so risky, everyone. I imagine if that was Aurelia. Oh, this, this is going to be stupidly close, man. We need to win this round. If we don't win this round and we're in such little health... The chances of getting to level, like, using all my gold nearly to get to level 10 and also finding an Aurelia is just such slim chance. It's so slim that we'll be able to do both. We'll get to 10, but then to find an Aurelia as well. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, Prage, everybody. The power of Mort Dog. If Aurelia's on the carousel, it fixes all of our problems. We also, if we can just win this round, it, it makes a big change. This guy's got an Aurelia, and we don't win this round. Oh, dear. Oh, God. Aurelia on carousel. Aurelia on carousel. So, from what I've heard, if you get Story Weaver 10 Kale, it's nearly the equivalent of a three-star a three star five cost. Nearly. Oh, there's one! Oh! 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 Oh, I'm hacking! <laughs> yeah! Come on! Come on! If I don't win this game now, it's gonna be so. If I just get, if I get like lose the first round, I have no idea. If we just like, oh, we're ten story weaver first combat dead. That can't happen. No way. Oh, we just have enough eco. Boomba. <laughs> there it is, baby. There it is. Oh, eh, oh my God, that's a good shot for me. We'll uh, lock that in. <coughs> if I lose the first round, I'm gonna be so sad. Here we go. Let's see. Oh, it's against a really tanky guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Her damage is crazy. <laughs> power. The power. 15,000 damage. <laughs> okay. I think we won. I think we've won. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. The only way I think we lose potentially is if someone gets a three star five cost. Because I've heard she's not. This Kale is technically not as strong as a three star five cost. Technically. 
which is just below power of a three star five cost. Technically. Oh, so this guy Swanfield is number one right now. Who did I just beat? Oh, I just beat him. He was the guy in first place and we just crushed him. Here we go. We're against this guy on 14 health. So he's got some powerful units. You know, that's a really tanky frontline guy. Unfortunately for him, I don't think it's enough. <laughs> oh my god! 26,000 damage! Okay! So yeah, this might be uploaded on Huzzy Extra. I did say I want to start uploading more of these on Huzzy Extra. Like, try to get this the, the Huzzy Extra channel going a little bit again. I've got some ideas of, like, little games that I want to do actual playthroughs of. And there's a game coming out soon called Mana Lords. And I actually potentially want to do a playthrough of Mana Lords. Uh, maybe live stream it on a weekend. And then upload, like, maybe the whole VOD or, like, you know part the vod up in like half an hour videos like i did back in the day with prison architect and yeah we got prison architect 2 coming out i want to do a playthrough of that so i want to try and revive Huzzy extra a little bit Okay. Stick to the plan. We have a plan. <laughs> Just gave me a tactician's crown. Um, sure. <laughs> like what? <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Hey, serpent. Oh my god! The enemy team just doesn't exist! They just don't exist! Yeah, again, for the YouTube audience that might be watching this, I do a TFT as my warm-up to let the audience build, let my voice kind of warm up a little bit. Riot's giving me the blessing of eternity because I'm about to probably have a terrible solo queue session. <laughs> oh wait, there's two sets. I'm gonna just lock again. I wanted. I always wanted to replace the jacks with set. I know at this point it probably doesn't matter, but you know, min max and that. Oh my days! That's so funny. That's so funny. Oh no! He got Lee Sin two star. This guy is the guy in first place on a massive win streak. <laughs> well, your win streak has ended, friend. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, and then, oh, this this is my ghost. So my like ghosts obviously aren't very strong, because like you can see, this Kale is not using her absolute power because I guess ghosts don't get that power. It's so weird. Oh, she doesn't get the items. Oh. That makes sense. She doesn't get these three, which obviously is what makes her crazy. So yeah, her active, by the way, is fire a wave of current target that deals basically 5,000 damage. <laughs> uh... Okay. It's basically whoever doesn't fight me will come second, I think. So this guy, this is the guy that just beat my ghost, technically. But the difference, obviously, of the ghost and the real deal is the real deal actually properly attacks. Boomba. So it seems like the other two, they're fairly even with each other. Do, do. He's eight duelist. 
But I, I, I'm just going to take Duelist Spat so I can get two Duelists for Aurelia. I know it's irrelevant. It's the Kale's doing literally all the damage. Aurelia did 1500, so like it doesn't really matter. But, you know, every little help. Every little helps. <clears throat> what a game. I can't believe, like, at the, right at the beginning of the game, it was like, oh, I wonder if we can do a 10 Story Weaver game. We actually managed to pull it off. Crazy. Oh, this is the first time I've ever done it. First time I've ever done it. How's this fight? So who wins between these two then? Because again, their strength seems pretty similar. Irelia is attacking properly now, but not enough. Wow. So wait, the duelist guy is losing, I think. Yeah. Yeah, that guy is just a pile of poros. I really want it. It's cool. I like it. Okay. Yeah, the One comp annoys me. I don't know if in recent patch they've nerfed it, but like, oh, the Titan. What the heck? Oh my god, he's going for three star Wukong. Okay, thank god he's dead. He was actually really close to three star Wukong. He just sold everything in hopes he'd find it, I think. Because he thought, I think he was like, that was my only chance of winning. Which I think it was. Wow. I, I respect it. The thing is, though, yeah, he, oh, right, yeah. He, the reason he did that, he was the guy that was losing to obviously both of us. So he's like, well, I can't win. My only chance would potentially um, getting a three-star Wukong. Is three star Wukong the strong? The rumor, again, I don't know if it's official, is this Kale, which is 10 story we have a Kale, is nearly the equivalent of a three star five cost, but she doesn't quite have that strength. So potentially Wukong might have been able to win. Not a guarantee, but yeah. I don't need all this gold. I'm back up to 50 eco. Okay. Okay. Three star Aurelia. The game's about to be over though. I don't know, will he lose on this round or will it take another round? Might be one more round. This actually is not going quick. What the heck? Has he gotten really stronger or have I gotten weaker? I have no idea. He's not dead. Oh, he is dead. There we go. There we go. GG. See, I'll upload that to the Extra. If you guys enjoyed, do throw a like on it. And yeah, that was fun. And I'll try to do this more often to keep that, like, kind of get the Huzzy Extra channel a bit alive again. But as I said, I mainly want to use Huzzy Extra either for, yeah, good TFT games or uploading other games. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Call down the reckoning to bring back hope and peace. Restore our glory to live forever. Bring down the dark regime. I know how to unleash eternal peace.